What is the most frustrating thing about having autism? Huh, where do I begin? <laughs> you know, uh, yeah, that's uh, that is a really easy but uh, hard to answer question, in all honesty. So I will uh, start with the basics. I'll start with uh, with the easiest uh, answer for this first. I think the most frustrating thing about having autism in general is is uh, most likely being able to fit in, if you know what I mean. You know, if you think about it, it's like uh, it's like they uh, think of uh, similar things, and I tend to uh, think of uh, much different things. You know, like um, you know, like what goes in the mind, or or you know how to behave on certain areas too. It's like you know, it's uh, many of the interests that that people would uh, would have. I kind of kind of have. Uh, uh, something completely different. Something that I can, uh, that I would actually be uh, more towards, you know, hey, this actually makes uh, me happy. And it doesn't really make you happy, and you know, that's okay. That's, you know, that's, uh, you know I feel, I feel good. You know, when I think of uh, this particular thing as well. <laughs> so, um, so yeah, just being able to fit in all kind of like the thing that's really frustrating for me. <laughs> I hear a dog over there, and I hear this little airplane noise. As well. <laughs> anyway, uh, anyway, the uh, point is uh, is that I kind of get easily distracted as well, and I, I think uh, that's what I kind of did unintentionally. There's that dog again, and um, and uh, yeah, you know, a bunch of distractions too. You know, even back when I was in elementary, in middle school, and in high school too, it was uh, you know I'm kind of easily distracted person, especially when there's like uh, computer games right set right in front of me. When I'm supposed to be working, you know, <laughs> and you, you can imagine how difficult that can be as well. So, um, so what we do is we kind of just uh, go with uh, go with a new schedule, a new routine. You know, if you do if you do your work, if you do this, you get rewarded. I kind of figured um, uh, the rewards for uh, for doing this particular video would be uh, probably uh, would be probably just to hit a few baseballs here and there, because that's uh, that's one of my favorite uh, things uh, to do is, is baseball. Watching it and playing it, and you know, I used to, I used to play a bunch of baseball back then, and and you know, it, it's kind of, it's kind of fun. It's uh, it's a lot of fun. So that'll be my reward. It's also kind of frustrating as uh, as well for having autism is it's when people kind of can they kind of they take it easy on me. You know, I take it uh, easy, like especially with sports. So too, I remember when uh, when I was playing football. You know, people were you know uh, were being. Uh, or being open, and I was the only one that's wide open. It's like, uh, why aren't people, uh, why aren't people covering me? You know, <laughs> it's like, um, it's like, you know, even when it's like uh, not just football, but, but, uh, but uh, baseball and and you know, hockey and and uh, basketball as as well. It's like uh, they let me uh, score a few points and all that kind of stuff. But you know, that's really frustrating too because it's like, why aren't they coming at me? Why aren't they not? Uh, or why are they? Um, uh, you know, not playing, yeah, playing, uh, why are they not playing hard at me? You know, it's like, uh, when they play easy on me, when, when it comes to competition, you know, that's, um, that to me is, is probably the most frustrating to me too, because it's like, uh, it's like once autism is, is in the, uh, is in the, is in the air, people assume that, oh, we better yeah, play easy on, on, uh, on little Tyler McNamer. And, and uh, you know, to me, that's you know, that's that's the one thing that that kind of makes me uh, frustrated the most, and all that kind of stuff too. It's like, it's like, come on, guys, uh, you know, play hard at me. I I can take a hit, <laughs> you know, <laughs> just just treat me like any other athletes, you know, that kind of stuff. And to me, that's um, to me, I kind of figured, you know, that's that that's like, uh, for me personally, that's uh, that's the uh, that's the only thing that uh, that makes me the most frustrated. Now, when it comes to like you know fitting in and. And feeling a little secluded, uh, you know, that's that's kind of hurtful too. But, and, and but it's not as much um, as it were to competition. The main reason why is because you know, for me, for me personally, and, and I know it's different for a lot of people. But, but I don't mind the solitude. I I don't mind the, uh, I don't mind uh, you know being on uh, being on my own or by myself and all that kind of thing. Because, because you know, it's uh, it feels good. You know, it feels nice to. You know, just uh, just hang out and just do some reading. And yeah, so you know, everyone's different in their own kind of ways. So, you know, when it comes to uh, when it comes to competition, uh, being in your own solitude, when it comes to trying to fit in, or uh, or just say, uh, you know, the whole idea of uh, of uh, people not to understanding one another. You know, that's that's another thing too. It's like uh, you know, I feel like no one has understood me yet. 
So, so what did I do? I start writing. I start writing. Uh, I start writing Population One, and then after that, after uh, after a good few years um, of it uh, of it being sold, I decide to write again. I decide to write another book, Becoming One, and to me that uh, that makes me feel so good. Uh, if you're feeling uh, frustrated for uh, for certain things, talk about uh, talk about with um, you know, with people that you know, people that you trust, uh, people that you love. And to also to yourself, and you know, when you're feeling frustrated, when you feel like, oh, I gotta get rid of this uh, this energy, take it off of um, uh, with uh, with your art, and also especially, and also especially with a sport as well, uh, as well, like baseball or or golf, tennis, uh, and and boxing, and even boxing as uh, as well. And so, um, yeah, it's always it's always really neat. It's always really neat to find these to find these alternatives to get to rid of all that frustration because, you know, like it or not, it's gotta. It's got to come out eventually, so uh, be sure to find it in a very healthy way. That's that's good for you and also good for others as well. So, um, uh, so you know, because everyone gets frustrated, you don't have to have autism to uh, to be frustrated. It's, it's how we, it's how we um, deal with it that that matters. The way I kind of think of it is, you can't get rid of frustration. You got to negotiate with it. Uh, you can't get rid of autism, so you got to negotiate with it. And that's pretty much what it's uh, all about too. And it can be. Uh, can be a nice experience too, you know. They they will come up. They come up. It's it's how you deal with it that uh, that matters too. And you can be um, optimistic about this uh, as well, because take it from me, you know, I've I've been kind of going through those uh, things for a very long time, and uh, it's how we how we deal with it that uh, that makes us move forward. So uh, so without further ado, I think I'm gonna get some. I think I'm gonna get some home runs uh, afterwards too. So uh, so uh, I'll catch you in the next one. See ya.